still don't understand. The cabin is such a romantic place. I was hoping... I know, I know, but it just... It just didn't work out that way. What happened? I get the feeling you already know. You've seen Liam, haven't you? Imagine my surprise when Kitty told me he was at the office. Yeah, when he thought he wasn't Big Bear with me. I had high hopes. I know. What did Liam say? Among other things, that you told him to leave. Why would you do that? Well, that's not exactly what happened, but... You know, Liam and I, we, we've been here before. Not exactly in this spot, but... Just because Steffi is gone, it doesn't mean that she's not in his thoughts. And, I mean, when I'm with a guy, I, I want to know that he's committed to me. And only me. And Liam is just, um... He's just not quite there yet. But he will be. I know he will be. And when he is, you will be the first to know. <laughs> what the hell were you thinking? Why do I get this feeling? What feeling? That more happened up in Big Bear than you're saying. Mm, maybe because it did? Are you going to tell me? Yes. Yeah, I'll tell you, but you're not going to believe it. I'm not even sure I do. <laughs> oh my gosh. You fell and you hit your head? Yeah, but I'm fine. But honey, you said you were unconscious. Only for a minute. And I woke up to a kiss. Oh, really? That is so romantic of Liam. Nope, not Liam. What? Mm -mm. I, I'd never seen him before. Uh, well, not before I had taken a picture of him naked. What, what, wait, <laughs> whoa. Wait a minute, back up. Okay, first of all, you said you were walking through the woods. I was, I was, and then I saw this guy taking a solar shower and it was just so odd and he was so attractive. I couldn't resist taking a picture. But he saw me and then I ran away. <laughs> and he went after you. Yes, and that's when I fell and hit my head and I, I woke up to him kissing me. Okay, wait. All of this happened after you told Liam to leave? Yes. Yes. Okay. Um, this guy, he, he, he carried me back to the cabin and he took care of me. He was really, he was very sweet. And then before I left Big Bear, I, I went back to where his tent was to thank him, but he wasn't there. I, I have no idea who he is or, <laughs> or his name or anything. And I lost my phone while I was r running through the woods. I can't find it. Oh, honey, don't worry about your phone. We'll get you another one. <laughs> but when we do, promise me you're not going to go taking pictures of naked men in the woods. Where do you think I learned it? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> it's good to feel appreciated. I, I know. I understand. But Liam loves you so much. Oh, my gosh. You know what? That is Katie. I remember I have to meet with her soon. Tell her you're on your way. Oh, are you yeah, sure? no, I'm sure, I'm sure. I'm, I'm fine. Okay. Sleeping Beauty is awake. It's um, the end of that fairy tale. Back to reality. Well, whoever it was, it went to voicemail. This is yours, right? 
You okay? Not once for yes. Yeah, no, yeah, 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 I'm fine. <laughs> I just, I'm... How did you get past the front gate? Well, your gardeners were hauling some stuff out, so I just slipped in. I mean, I rang the front doorbell, but nobody answered, so... I figured I'd just check back here, just in case. Just in case what? In case I got lucky. And you were taking a solar shower out. Oh. I think that's a good place for it over there. <laughs> okay. It's quite the spread you got here, Miss Hope Logan. Daughter of fashionista Brooke Logan. It's amazing who you meet out in the woods these days. Let's get a picture of that. Show me shocked. Okay. Show me shocked. Okay. Do shocked again. Um, yeah, there's yeah. Snappy. Okay. Yeah. Thank You're good you. At this. Thank you. Yeah. For bringing this back. <laughs> and you are. Well, I was hoping we could discuss that over a cup of coffee. Cup of coffee. I mean, the way I see it, you kind of owe me. Oh. I mean, awakening Sleeping Beauty and returning the cell phone to you. I owe you. Yeah. Yeah, all right. Yeah. yeah. Um, okay. But how about I do you one better? My brother is having a 4th of July party at Bikini. Why don't you come? As your date? You can be my mystery man. <laughs> oh, with an offer like that, who can resist? <laughs> I'll grab you an invitation. Okay. Wyatt. <laughs> 